Hi, my name is Rick Bogart. I'm with Ellisys, Western Regional Sales Manager. Ellisys uh, provides uh, Bluetooth test equipment, and it's mostly for developers, uh, and that would be the hearing aid developers and hearing aid products manufacturers. Our tool is very easy to show. The uh, spectrum diagram that we have here, and then they could see throughout the 2.4 gigahertz range uh, where the energy is and how it interacts with Wi-Fi and Zigbee and Thread and these other technologies. Which we, we use our tool for coexistence testing. Coexistence is uh, that there's more than one technology working together in the same spectrum. The audiologists that have come up uh, and have been uh, stopping by the booth have been very interested in understanding more about AuraCast. What they've been impressed with is the some of the features such as lower power and lower uh, latency, uh, which will improve the quality uh, of the hearing aids. But then there's additional features by from Orcast. Hi, I'm John Yee, CEO of Packacraft. I'm here at HearTech in Seattle, 2023. And uh, we're here in the uh, Ellisys booth uh, demonstrating our Auracast. Uh, we, are, we have a um, a video playing in the back here, transmitting off of a, um, a Nordic NRF5340 uh, Devalma board, and it's being received on uh, these devices here, and uh, and you can listen to it from an infinite number of receivers. Today we're uh, introducing our uh, Auracast source application running on the Nordic Thingy53 uh, that has a digital microphone, and we can uh, Use this with the battery in it, we can use it as a microphone, uh, transmitting to our Auracast receiver uh, where we can uh, listen to a microphone broadcast. Okay, uh, we're gonna test the range uh, of this uh, Auracast transmitter here in the uh, expo hall. And I'm gonna, we'll do this in time lapse so you don't have to watch me walk all the way down to the other end of the, the expo. So we got maybe um, almost to the end of the hallway there, which is, uh, could be, I'm, I don't know how long it is, maybe uh, 50, 100 meters, somewhere around there. So we got a pretty decent range, even here in the, uh, in the showroom, where there's a lot of wireless activity happening. 